The National Basketball Association has introduced a new annual tournament competition where all 30 teams will compete. Today, we'll dive into the NBA Cup, exploring its format, its impact on the regular season, and the exciting new rewards that await the teams competing for glory. Welcome to Lurks Lessons, and this is everything you need to know about the NBA Cup. The tournament begins with group play. All 30 teams will be split up into six groups, with three in the East and three in the West. They are separated based on their previous regular season records. How this is determined is that the top three best teams per conference are placed in a pot with the best record. The second pot has the next three best teams and so on and so forth. I'm using the 2022-23 NBA season results as our example. Once the pots are configured, the groups are then randomly drawn. This gives a balanced approach to ensure good competition rather than having one group be overpowered with the best teams in their conference. Here are the groups for the 2023-24 NBA Cup. With the groups organized, each team will play one game against each opponent in their group, with two games at home and two on the road. Currently, these tournament games will be played on Tuesdays and Fridays during the month of November and will have a tailored tournament custom court design installed. Even though these games are for tournament play, they will also count to the team's regular season record. If you enjoy learning about sports or sports related topics, please consider subscribing and hitting that like button. Once group play has been completed, the knockout round is up next in the month of December. Each best team from each group makes it to the knockout stage along with two wildcard teams. The wildcard teams are determined with the next best record in each conference from group play. If two teams are tied within a group, tiebreakers like head-to-head -head record, point differential, and total points scored in group stage will be exercised. In both conferences, the teams with the strongest performance in the group play games will earn the right to host quarterfinal games, while the wildcard team will be welcomed by the team boasting the best record in group play games. With the bracket set of the final eight teams, the single elimination games will commence with the quarterfinals and semifinal games counting as regular season games. The championship game will not be counted. Instead, the final two teams, East versus West, will compete for the NBA Cup. Other honors will include MVP of the competition, along with an all-tournament team based on tournament play. Finally, a prize pool will be allocated to the players on the team that make it to the knockout rounds, with funds increasing all the way to the championship game. The reason behind the NBA introducing an early season tournament is to give teams another form of competition and to engage fan interest in new ways. It remains to be seen if this format will indeed increase attention, especially with the National Football League dominating sports interests in the months of November and December. We shall see. If you enjoy sports educational content and want to support this channel while getting exclusive perks, behind the scenes access, and bonus content, consider becoming a patron today. All right, everyone, my name is Jeff Lurkey, and I'll catch you all in the next lesson.